What do pancakes and burgers have in common? They are both a lot more delicious when they're nice and brown. It's pretty obvious that this burger and this pancake feature better browning than the others. And browning equals big flavor. These are definitely the ones that I would like to eat. Now you can see that they're all cooking on the exact same griddle and they're actually identical except for one ingredient, baking soda. That's right, I added a small amount of baking soda to this pancake and this burger. Now it's not that the baking soda itself is browning, it's that it's making the food brown better. The browning on burgers and pancakes is a result of the Maillard reaction. That's when sugars and the amino acids that make up protein come together in the presence of heat to form hundreds of new flavor compounds. And that reaction occurs best in an alkaline environment or when the pH is high. And baking soda raises the pH. So if your baked goods turn out paler than you want, next time try adding a quarter to a half teaspoon of baking soda. Not for lift, but for better browning. And same goes for your next beef roast. When you season with salt and pepper, try adding one teaspoon of baking soda for every three pounds of meat. You'll have better browning and a much more flavorful crust. Thanks for watching America's Test Kitchen. What'd you think? Well, leave a comment and let us know which recipes you're excited to make, or you can just say hello. You can find links to today's recipes and reviews in the video description. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you later. I'll see you later.